and just don't break none of the rules. And we're ready to go. We're off and running here at Kins Twin Cities Wrestling Association. Let's hear the bell. Hello folks, this is Ray Johnson here, right here with the TWA show number 28. And we've got some great matches coming up here as you saw in that news flash. We're going to have Rich Taylor here in a moment to help commentate on these great matches coming up. We've got, of course, a grudge match between um, um, Sean Crossan and Jackknife Jacob. Should be a good one. Crusher Crossan is very angry, I'll tell you that right now. Okay, Rich Taylor has just walked in. Rich, welcome back to show number 28. This is your second show here. What do you think? Well, I don't know who this young, this young whatever his name is. I forgot his name. I've had to do that. But it looks like he's getting draped around the ring a little bit. Um, that kid is Matt Kelsey. It looks like he could use a little bit of education in the ways of the TWA. And I think he'll get it right here with Brian Peterson, also a fairly newcomer. This is only his second show. That's right. We've got a couple of inexperienced young men here. Should be up-and-coming stars in the TWA, ready to challenge Crusher Crossan for that title. Definite, definitely. Brian Peterson, of course. Oh, there's Crusher Crossan right there. He is m managing uh, Matt Kelsey, I do believe. Brian Peterson is on Jackknife Jacob's side. Just part of the family feud. Every match here has something to do with the family feud. Oh, no doubt. The Jacob, the Jacob family and the Crusher family are, are the mainstays of TWA wrestling. Not many wrestlers can come in without going either one, or one side or the other. Okay, and um, as you saw in the news flash, we've, Merciless Mike will not be able to wrestle. You saw that interview, Rich. What, just exactly in a nutshell, what was Mike saying? Well, Mike's just saying, issuing a warning basically to Jackknife Jacob that uh, he's going to be on Jackknife's case as soon as he gets back. And that may be as early as next show. We'll see. Okay. Okay, now he's into the other rope. Coming in. Oh, an elbow right to the, right below the right part of the rib cage right there, probably um, in the abdominal area. Okay. A fist to the midsection. Okay, and there's some more moves. He continues to pound on Brian Peterson, obviously. Probably expected to win this match, no doubt. But we shall see. Time will tell. Time will tell. This kid should may know a little bit more than he might. This kid, well, excuse me, this kid here, Matt Kelsey, should know more. Might know more than we thought he did about wrestling. But right now, it sh seems that he is still has a lot to learn. A whole lot, Rob. Excuse me, Ray. Got my announcing partners mixed up there. Yeah, one of the things about wrestling is is you need endurance. And whoever can go the longest, no matter how much punishment they can dish out or take, time will tell. Okay, and now Matt Kelsey's got Bryant Peterson down, but no real surprise there. I was watching a few WWF matches the other night, and very much the same thing happened. And um, a man by the name of... Um, Lombardi, his last name was. John Lombardi, I believe. I believe John Lombardi was the man. He was wrestling Nikolai Volkov. And he had a very good moves against um, the, the Russian, um, this Lombardi guy. But it just goes to show what the inexperience could do, but he certainly gave him an education. Okay, we've got one more minute left in this match. This is a very short match. And um, we'll be notified, I'm sure. And there, Merce, um, Mike Ackman, the referee, is obviously been notified. And he, w and he will stop the match in time. Should be counted out of the ring now. Yeah, this, this match kind of slow getting underway. Ten minutes is not really enough time for anyone to establish something. you got to go in there, go with a quick submission hold, something to get your opponent stunned for a while and give him the quick pin before he knows it. Pressure cross, and I don't know. Have, I haven't seen him interfere yet, but it may be his intentions in the corner there, but no more than any other wrestler might do that if they're the manager. They hate to see their man pin. Oh, there it is. Three count there. Brian Peterson defeats Matt Kelsey, a newcomer still to the TWA.
Okay, folks, we're going to get right on with the next match here in a moment. Vicious hammers on Crusher Crossing. But Crusher Crossing, that boy's got a temper. He's flailing right back. Oh, he's got a mounting offense of his own right now. I mean, he's had to wrestle fair and square, and sometimes that can work to his disadvantage. Uh, yeah, he is. That's one of his. Um. Oh, nice. It looks like the. Look at that newcomer. He doesn't know how to handle himself yet. He's been in the PWA. 